Good morning, everybody. I'm meteorologist Amber Lee. We are gearing up for very hot temperatures today. In fact, peak heat this afternoon. So it's very important that you drink plenty of water even when you're not thirsty. So get some ice beverage because our inland communities are looking at temperatures in the 80s, 90s, and triple digits. So I would say make it an extra large. This is the reason why we are dealing with very hot temperatures. We have this high pressure system that's really pushing in unseasonably hot conditions where we're looking at temperatures in the 80s, 90s, triple digits. That's well above average for this time of the year. Not only are we expecting hot temperatures today, but also spilling into Saturday. So during this time, hot, dry, gusty conditions with low humidity means elevated fire danger, especially for the higher elevations. And then that cool down begins as we head into Sunday. Some of the hottest temperatures will be over our desert communities. Everything you see here in hot pink, excessive heat till Saturday for the high desert, Sunday for the Coachella Valley, and then everywhere else inland as you get away from the coast under this heat advisory, what you see in orange. Great reminder during this time to know the difference between heat exhaustion and heat stroke. Heat stroke, you could have a throbbing headache, no sweating, but your skin is red hot and dry. Both will have nausea and vomiting. Rapid strong pulse is a big indicator of the heat stroke, and then you could even lose consciousness. Now, if you or someone else is dealing with any of these symptoms, please call 911. Otherwise, heat exhaustion, get into a cool place, drink plenty of water, possibly take a cool shower to try and cool down. Our temperatures remain above average through Saturday. Finally, some relief, some cooler air Sunday and Monday, but that hot weather returns by the middle latter part of next week. Valleys will stay in the triple digits through Saturday. Inland Empire also into Saturday. And then here's a look at the beaches, the high deserts, and then also our mountain community. So just know that it's going to stay hot, unseasonably warm through Saturday. Some relief on Sunday, but still warmer than normal. And then finally, a little bit more of the cooler air Monday before another round of hot weather arrives by Wednesday.